The week was long, your feet are tired, could use a vacation. Just gather round and join the dub. It's Monday Motivation. Monday Motivation. Hey friends, good Monday morning to you. How's everybody this Monday as we are well into October now? I think we're in the second week of October, second full week, and we're enjoying it here. We have lovely weather. Uh, it's, it's been nice. And before we go any further, don't forget to use the hashtag BeatUpFit. Leave a positive thing that you've done for yourself mentally, physically, emotionally, otherwise, in the comments. Be entered to win prizes all month long in October. Tell me the thing that you did last week for your relief. That's a good thing you did. But let's get to our quote for this week. And that is from F. Scott Fitzgerald, very famous, most of you know that. Life starts all over again when it gets crisp in the fall. And our Monday motivation this week is again, thinking about fall, thinking about autumn, but I like the word crisp there. I like the word crisp. Life starts all over again when it gets crisp in the fall. So here in Georgia, we have trick fall. So you've got summer and then you've got the pit of Beelzebub summer. And then you've got Satan's armpit summer and you've got more summer. And then you've got make believe fall that leads back to Satan's front porch summer where you think it's going to be fall for like four days and it's beautiful and glorious and then suddenly it's 99 degrees again. And then eventually you get into actual fall. But even now in October, again, in October, we'll still have some kind of uncomfortable days, some hot days, some humid days. It isn't crisp yet. For us, it tends to be closer to Thanksgiving uh, or, you know, kind of that Halloween going into Thanksgiving, you know, end of October, beginning of November. That's when it starts to get crisp, where it, you feel a little bit of a chill at night. But during the day, it's, it's glorious. Hoodie weather, so to speak. And not necessarily coat weather, but hoodie weather, where you can wear the hoodie all day long and it works for whatever it is that you need to do. My favorite time of year. Uh, in high school football, when I played coach high, high school football, that's the time of year you're getting into playoffs right? That's the time that you, you're excited for. Uh, it's just my favorite time of the year. My favorite holiday is Thanksgiving. I very much enjoy uh, all the festivities that happen in the fall with Halloween stuff and fall festivals, getting to Thanksgiving, getting to Christmas, New Year's. So my favorite time of year with in, in Thanksgiving sitting right there in the middle, absolutely my very favorite. And that's when it's crisp. And that's when F. Scott Fitzgerald is saying life starts all over again. Now, when you think about what's actually the, true, all of the leaves are falling and the trees are barren. And then as spring comes, they grow back and they become green again. So you're seeing the, the end of the life of those leaves and the decay and, and they are beautiful for a time and then they're gone and they're withered. That crisp time is when they're beautiful, where they're still gold and red and brown before they fall off. And it's like the twilight of those leaves' lives. And that's when it's crisp. And that's when life is about to begin again for that tree. And we're going to go through the winter and start a new cycle of growth. For us, life starts all over again when it gets crisp in the fall. I think the best time to do self-reflection, set goals, is the fall. I don't think it's New Year. New Year is arbitrary. It's all arbitrary. But New Year, you do it, and it's right after you've had lots of holidays, lots of goodie pie cakes, snacks. You haven't worked as much. You know you haven't been healthy. You, you have been engorging on things. And so you go, all right, new year, new me. I'm going to start all over. I'm going to get back to the gym. But really, that first month, you're just working to get off of what you put on those couple months in December, November. But fall, it's not freezing cold. It's not the doldrums of winter. You still have all the holidays to look forward to. And you're excited. You're excited about the end of the year. You're excited about a new year maybe at work, new opportunities. Maybe you get a raise every year. The weather is much nicer. You want to be outside. You want to experience it. And that's the time that we should assess and think about how we want life to start over for us for the next year. When it's crisp in the fall, when it's beautiful outside, in that hoodie weather, where you're standing by a fire, where you go to some sort of event, and you can just sit and reflect. We take vacation as a fact. As a matter of fact, as you're watching this, we're in vacation right now at the beach. October is a weird time to go to the beach, we've, but we've gone for the last several years, October, November time frame. It's kind of chilly, especially with the, the breeze coming off the water. There's not many people there. Most people vacation in the summer. But when like Haya has a fall break, we try to get up to the beach. And it's such a good time of reflection, of self-evaluation, 
because you could walk on the beach and be the only person there. When I ran a half marathon a couple years ago, it was on that beach in this time frame, and there was basically no one out there. The whole several hours, I had that time to myself to do reflection, to do evaluation. And I encourage you, this is the time that life starts all over again. So think about it. Think about the things, the changes you want to make, the big changes you want to make, the larger changes. What would you like to do? Where do you want to go? This is the time of year to start making those changes for next year, to do that evaluation when it's crisp outside. So I encourage you, as we get to October, November, find a festival or a, a hayride or whatever it is in your part of the world. And I know not all parts of the world are in this weather. Some folks have summer right now. Sit outside, reflect, evaluate, and think about how you want your life to start all over when the time is crisp. And as we will wind down this year of Beat Up Fit that we did together, and you start the new year in 2023, be focused before you get to January. Have your goals established and already be working toward them during this wonderful time of year. Thanks for being with me. I'll talk to you next week.